Alright, if I hook a fish right here, I really don't know how I'm gonna get him through all these weeds, all this grass. I think I can do it, but it's gonna be kind of tricky. And then again, I don't have a choice because this is like the only other spot that I can get to that's not covered in moss. We got that balanced leech under an indicator. I can't see any yet, but uh, it doesn't mean they're not there. That's a money cast if there's any fish right there. Guys, I just spotted the first fish of the day. Cruising right there. Oh, oh, he's going over to it. He's moving towards it. He's moving over to it. There he is. There he is. He's got it. There we go. Fish on. Good fish. Good fish. Oh, baby. Here we go. This is a nice. Oh, it's a giant, dude. It's actually really big. Keep him out of the grass. This is gonna be interesting. This is a freaking giant for this lake. I just spotted him swimming out there. I had turned my camera off, turned it back on, threw it over to him. He came right over and ate it. He's not even, he's kind of fighting weird. Like he's fighting, but he's kind of just rolling around. This is like the worst spot to try to land a fish. I'm gonna have to try to drag him through the grass. I mean, this is water right here. Dude, I don't know what to do. Is this even? Okay, you know what I'm gonna do, guys? I'm gonna just go out and get him. Come on, please don't pop off. Please don't pop off. Whew. All right, all right. Shoes are off. How deep is this water? Oh, it's, it's deep. Hold on, this might not be. Oh yeah, I don't think that's happening, you guys. That is deep water. I cannot even fill the bottom. I'm gonna have to just try to drag him through. There's nothing else I can do. I can feel him. I can feel him. He's right there. Oh, come on. Almost got him. We're gonna get him. Got him. Oh my, what? No way, no way. What did I just catch? That's a grayling. That is a, that's a record grayling. That is a record grayling. Guys, I think I just caught a record arctic grayling. Oh my gosh. What did I just catch? <laughs> That's not a cutthroat. Oh my gosh. I'm kinda, I'm kinda speechless right now, you guys. I've heard of the possibility of there being Arctic grayling in this lake. Never have I seen one. I didn't think it was a possibility, but I just caught probably like a freaking pound and a half grayling on a leech. Oh my gosh. Folks, keep in mind, Arctic grayling don't get giant. I mean, this is probably like a, this is a certified trophy. Oh, hold on. Hold on, let's get the hook out of him. Well, there we go. That is my personal best Arctic grayling. That is just unbelievable. I cannot believe I just caught that. Wow, that's crazy. I want you guys to observe on his top fin. Like, you know, grayling have this big giant fin on top. It's like, kind of like lumpy right there. Like there's a tumor in it or it was just kind of chewed up and it healed weird. It's just a little kind of weird. Super pretty fish though. All right, well, I can't release this fish right here, obviously, unless I like throw him 10 feet. So I'm gonna run him over to that bank so I can let him go. I've kept him in the water. He should be ready to go. Oh, there he goes. He's trying. All right, there he goes. There he goes. He's just tired. He's trying to get through all these weeds right here. He's kicking. There he goes. You got like an inch or two of thick weeds and then underneath it's nice and clear open. I cannot believe I just caught that fish. And like I said, I've heard rumors of there possibly being some grayling in this lake. There's not many. And the ones that are in here have obviously been in here for a while. That was a giant. I don't know how old grayling live, but that guy was probably towards the end of his life. You could just tell he didn't fight very hard. He was just kind of sluggish, even swimming away. That's insane. That honestly makes the trip right there. Personal best grayling.